Hi drummers, hope you're well. Quick video for you about holding the drumstick. This is going to be short and sweet, but I thought it deserved its own video. What we're going to do here is give it a pinch between your index finger and your thumb, about one third of the way up from the base here. And we're talking here about the, I think of it as the crease there, the top crease in your index finger. You see that one there? And the fleshy part of your thumb. Give it a pinch, as I say, about one third of the way up. Not too tight, not too loose. I always think, you know, when you've got this just right, because you can do that thing that we used to do, I used to do anyway, with, with your pencil at school, where you can look, make it look like it's going all bendy. You know that thing there? Yeah, man. I always think that's a great sign that you're not too tight, not too loose. Then the stick's gonna go through the crease in the base of your hand there, and then wrap your fingers around here, your middle finger, ring finger, and little finger around the stick. Again, not too tight, not too loose. That's the big theme here. And uh, I always think a great analogy is, imagine you had a little bird in your hand with its wings folded up. You wouldn't, of course, want to squeeze too tight and hurt it, but too loose, it would wriggle out and fly off. Uh, likewise, on an eggshell, imagine you had an egg with no inside in the palm of your hand, too tight, you would crack it, too loose, it would drop. It's just somewhere between those two. That's a great balance between being sort of light enough in your grip that you can be relaxed and smooth and things can flow around the kit, have a lovely musical feel, not be too tight, too rigid, but also being tight enough that you're not gonna sort of lose control, drop the stick or not be in control of the, the stroke each time you're hitting. So that's the thing. This is the match script, by the way. So both sticks held the same. Again, one time for to be clear, give it a pinch one third of the way up between your index finger and your thumb. Stick goes through the crease in the back of your hand there. Wrap your fingers around, not too tight, too, not too loose. When you throw it down, get that stick bouncing back up off the drum and you're up and running. You, sh you might have seen uh, sometimes drummers doing this as well. This is traditional grip. Uh, often jazzers or marching band drummers. We can get to that a bit later on. But when you're first starting, I reckon match grip is what it's all about for pop music, rock music, R&B. If you're into any of those sort of pop styles, that's the one. Go for it. Any questions, give us a shout. I'll see you on the next video for some quick drum rudiments and uh, drum beats. See you soon.